So dear students, today we want to discuss exercise 3.4, problem number 1, uh, problem number 2, 1. So the problem given, 2 given, form the pair of linear equation in the following problems and find their solutions if they exist by the elimination method. By elimination method, we construct the linear equations. If number 1 given, if we add 1 to the numerator and subtract 1 from denominator, a fraction reduces, reduces to 1. It becomes 1 by 2 if we only add 1 to the denominator. What is the fraction? Now, one fraction is given. In this fraction, if we add 1 to the numerator and subtract 1 from denominator, then the fraction becomes 1 and again the fraction will be 1 by 2 if we only add 1 to the denominator. Now what is the fraction? So no problem this is very easy solution. Solution let the fraction fraction be x by y. We consider this is the fraction x is numerator y is denominator. Now case 1, what is case 1? If we add 1 to the numerator that means with x and subtract 1 from denominator, so subtract 1 from denominator fraction reduces to 1. So case 1 if we add 1 to the numerator that means x plus 1 and subtract 1 from denominator y minus 1 then it reduces to 1 so answer is 1 we get if we add 1 to the numerator and add 1 subtract from denominator then the answer is it reduces to 1 so we multiplying this one this side x plus 1 equal to y minus 1 so x minus y uh, this is 1 taking left hand side 1 on 2 this is 0 first equation we get next case 2 in case 2 it becomes half the fraction will be half if we only add 1 to the denominator case 2 if we add 1 to the denominator the answer is half it becomes half it becomes up if we add only add 1 to the denominator. So this will be twice x. This is y plus 1. Twice x minus y minus 1 equal to 0. This 2 is our equation. From the pair of linear equation, this is one linear equation. This is another linear equation. These two are linear equation. And find their solution. Now we want to solve this. I recall this equation, first equation x minus y plus 2, uh, this taking 2 right hand side equal to minus 2, this is number 1 and second equation twice x minus y equal to 1, this is number 2. So this we solve by elimination method y y same this is minus or minus or just to subtract this two now one minus two implies one minus two implies x minus twice x minus x y y cancel minus one minus two minus one this is minus three so x equal to we get three the value of x is three putting the value of x equal to 3 in equation 1 we get we putting this value in equation number 1 we get so uh, 3 minus y minus 2 so 3 plus 
or we can write minus y equal to minus 2 minus 3. So, minus y equal to minus 5, y equal to 5. Therefore, we get x equal to 3, y equal to 5. These two values we get, but actually our fraction is x by y. Therefore, the required fraction is 3 by 5. The required fraction is 3 by 5. This is our answer. Now we consider problem number 2. 5 years ago, Nuri was twice as old as Sonu. 10 years later, Nuri will be twice as old as Sonu. How old Nuri and Sonu? Very interesting problem. So, we consider, we don't know the, their ages. So, we consider X and Y. This is your mean magic. So, we consider, let the let the age of Nuri be x years and the age of Shonu be y years, this y years. So, 5 years ago, 5 years ago, the age of Nuri was x minus 5 and the age of Shonu, age of Shonu was y minus 5. So, if ego given, we subtract this. Suppose my uh, one student whose age is 15 years. 5 years ago, what was the age? 15 minus 5, 10. This will be subtract. So, we subtract 5. So, case 1. Five years ago, Nuri was twice as old as Sonu. Case 1, Nuri is x minus 5. This is twice as old as Sonu. That means Nuri age is 3 times of Sonu. So, this implies x minus 5. This is 3y minus 15. This is x minus 3y. This is minus 15 plus 5. So, this will be x minus 3y equal to minus 10. This is number uh, 1 you consider. x minus 3y equal to minus 10. Again, 10 years later, again, 10 years, 10 years later, the age of Nuri will be x plus 10 just we adding 10 10 years later the age of Nuri will be x plus 10 and age of Shonu age of Shonu will be y plus 10 this is if letter or uh, what will be then this one given then this will be we adding this so nuri will be twice as old as sonu case 2 according to the question nuri means x plus 10 is twice as old as sonu that means nuri equal to 2 times of Shonu, this one. This implies x plus 10, this is twice y plus 20, 
x minus twice y equal to 20 minus 10 x minus twice y equal to 10 this is number 2 we get so we get 2 this is number 1 this is number 2 so I rewriting 1 is here uh, x minus 3y equal to minus 10 and x minus 2y equal to 10 this is number 1 this is number 2 I rewriting this now on el elimination method this minus this x x cancel now 1 minus 2 implies x x cancel we get 3y plus 2y this is minus y equal to minus 20 so minus 20 we get and y equal to 20 we get the value of y is 20 putting the value of y in equation number 1 so putting the value of y equal to 20 in equation 1 1 or 2 as you like in 1 we get uh, x minus 1 is this 3 y 3 into 20 equal to minus 10 so this will be x minus 60 equal to minus 10 so x equal to minus 10 plus 60 and x equal to 50 therefore x equal to 50 therefore x equal to 50 and y equal to 20 x means the age of Nuri and y means the age of Shonu. Therefore, the required age of Nuri equal to 50 years and the age of required age of Nuri and the age of Shonu equal to 20 years. This two is our answer. It's a very easy problem. Just you have to read the question attentionally. Ultimately, you will get the result. Just you have to remember if was given, we subtract and will be given, we adding. So, the solution is very easy and very interesting. Just we know the main medicine is practice mathematics is main medicine is practice without practice no one can say mathematics is difficult or uh, easy so with practice anybody can say mathematics is very easy very interesting so if these solutions are easy and you are new in my channel then please like this video click uh, like this video uh, subscribe my channel and click the bell icon thank you